Good morning. Two breaking news stories overnight. Another officer involved shooting near St. Louis. Also a chase and a deadly crash here in our metro area. Sarah Hollenbeck joins us live near with the chase ended in Kansas City. Sarah. It, 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 I mean, generally it's where it is. Hey, good morning, Judge. Uh, you might be able to see that over my shoulder over here. You see all those lights? That's where this car ended up. It's in a ditch and is flipped over. We're told that a man inside that car is dead, and a woman that he was with is now in the hospital. That man who died in his 20s, the woman in the hospital in her 30s. Now, we're told that right now there is an investigator in the hospital trying to talk to that woman. However, she was getting some surgery as well as some medical care, so we're not sure if she she's been able to speak with police. Now it all started with police trying to pull over a vehicle with those two inside in Independence near 40th and Pittman. The car would not stop, so Independence police chased that car for just a few short blocks before it lost control and flipped. Now right now those officers are in the hospital. They're trying to get more information from the woman there. We're also told that they are going to need a crane to pull the car out of the ditch. It's really deep in the ravine that you see on the side of the road behind us. So that's something that may take a a little while for them to get that car out, and then investigators are going to look through it for any additional evidence that they can find. Reporting live here in Kansas City, I'm Sarah Hollenbeck for Doing Action News.